Hello everyone. Greetings of the day. We Today we discuss on the regional Indian cuisine, that is Bengali cuisine. Scope: Understanding the geographical location, understanding the historical background, seasonal availability, understanding the special equipments, understanding the staple diet, understanding the specialty cuisine of festival and special occasions. Introduction. Bengali cuisine is a style of food preparation originating in Bengal, a region in the South Asia, Eastern South Asia, which is now divided between the independent country of Bangladesh and the Indian state of West Bengal. Bengali cuisine is well known for the vast range of rice dishes and various preparation of fresh water fish. Bengali cuisine is rich and varied with the use of many specialized spices and flavors. The speciality of Bengali food lies in the perfect blend of sweet and spicy flavor. For Bengalis, food is one of the most essential aspects of their day-to-day -day life. The staple food of Bengal is rice and fish. A typical Bengali needs to have a fish in every meal. Otherwise, there is a feeling that the meal is incomplete. There is an ample stock of fish in every household because fish is cooked frequently, almost on a daily basis. Even the Brahmin Bengali release fish. Fish is a part of every festivi festivity celebration. Bengali has a special season called Pans Forad, which includes five spices, mustard, star, uh, any seeds, fenugreek seeds, cumin seeds, and black cumin seeds, which is all of the equal quantity when we used. The principal medium of cooking is uh, mustard oil. A typical Bengali lunch or dinner will generally comprise of bath, rice, dal, and lentils. Tarkari, that is a vegetables, and matcher jol, followed by a sweet. Geographical location. The Bengal region lies in the low lying Gangas Brahmaputra River Delta or the Gangas Delta. The Gangas Delta arises from the confluence of the River Ganga, Brahmaputra, and Meghna River and their respective tributes or tributaries. The Bengal region today comprises of parts of West Bengal and Bangladesh. West Bengal is on the eastern neck of India and stretching from the Himalayas in the north to the Bay of Bengal to the south. In Bengal, the major practice of cultivation is of peri. The average rainfall over the region, the type of soil and the cultural practices refers or prefers the growth of peri. Historical background. Bengali food has inherited a large number of influences from both foreign travelers and Pan India. Bengali cuisine is perhaps the only cuisine in the India region which still holds its authenticity over thousands of years. Through the region by or has been ruled by the Mughal Emperor and was also the capital of British colonization. Through there has been great influences on the cuisines from the Nawabs, Chinese, Britishers, and Marwaris. The Nawabs or the Mughals rules the state for a very long time and Mughlai cuisine has had a great impact on the Bengali cuisine. The key culinary influence of the Christian community was the ritual of tea tradition introduced by the British and the Bengal snacks food tradition. Baking, which has pretty much unknown till the British come alone, became widespread. Chops and cutlets were once British in origin, but they are now from the Bengalis. Baghdadi Jews set up Kolkata's famous Jewish bakeries, which are now dead or dying, but their influence is everywhere. The Chinese community in India subcontinent are a community of immigrants and their dis descendants that immigrated from China to work at the 
चत्ती गोक एंड कोलकाता पोर्ट एम एस जी एंड स्वीट कॉर्न गॉट इनफ्यूज इन टू द पॉपुलर बेंगोली कुजीन और बेंगोली चाइनीज कुजीन इन वेस्ट बेंगाल कुजीन स्मॉल क्वालिटीज ऑफ शुगर इज एडेड टू इट डिशेस और इच डिशेस especially in vegetarian dishes differentiating it from bangladeshi cuisine there was also an influence of wido on the bengali cuisine seasonal availability with the local name and the english name characteristic of food Bengali cuisine can be subdivided into four different types of dishes. Charba or food that is chewed such as rice or fish. Chosya or food that has been sucked such as ambal and tak. Leya or food that are meant to be licked like chutney. pia which includes drink mainly or mainly milk specialty of kolkata in kolkata many local street vendors own small shops from which they sells their own homemade goods item like uh, cheese or paneer can be eaten as it or can be made into sweet sandesh rasgulla uh, chana payas Milk is specially used in Kolkata. Various type of pies different, differing in use of different grains and additives like date, figs, berries, etc. In addition to European food stuff like chocolate, Kolkata takes culinary influence from its Chinese diaspora. Puchka, which also known as a pani puri, is a common kind of Bengali street food made with a fried dough casing and a potato and chickpea filling. Usually round in small stall, found in small stall, alongside bell puri, masala chai, gugni, and chaat stalls. Special equipments used in the Bengali cuisines are as follows: chimta, sir sona, boti, guruni. Equipments: bonti, a curb raised blade. attached to a long flat cutting vegetables used for fish and meat the bonti used for fish and meat is kept separate from vegetable bonti and the non veg as bonti as implies scales of fish hari a uh, cooking pot with a rounded bottom neck slightly narrowed at the neck with a wide rim to facilitate holding while draining excess of rice water dekchi refers a saucepan without a handle usually a greater depth used for boiling sauteing etc karai is an indian wok which is made out of a cast iron probably a cooking pot shaped like a chinese wok but much deeper used for deep frying stir frying as well for preparation and sauce and gravy it's usually made of iron or aluminum and usually has two looped handles tawa is a griddle used for making parothas thala a circular plate of authenticity brass but not is of steel and uh, on which food is served equipments continues kunti a long handle implement of steel or iron with a flat thin belt set pieces with use as a stirrer hatha a metal spoon with indention used as stirrer and also for transferring food stuff sarashi an equipment used for holding vessels hot on range chutney a sheaf chamach a spoon silnura grinding stone which also known uh, it's uh, silbatta a slab of 16 inch by 10 inch and a small 
bolster shaped stone roller 9 inch long. Both the slab and roller are chipped from time to time as they are worn smooth. Equipment continues. Hammam Dasta, a motor and pistol. Then key a long wooden hand board mounted with a short pedestal in the middle. Much like a seesaw, the traditional Bengali instrument for taking the husk of the rice. Gutni is a wooden handle blender used for puree, lentils and sauce. Janjri, it is a large wear mass flat spoon used for deep frying fish or bread. There is a perforated one. Balloon chakki, that is your uh, round pastry board and a rolling pin. Kuruni, it is a unique tasker to grate coconut. Staple diet. The staple food of Bengali is fish and rice. It can be cooked in many different ways and distinct manners. Fish is a part of diet even for Brahmin Bengalis. The most preferred form of meal in Bengali is mutton or cod meat. Vegetable like jackfruit, bitter goat, bottle goat, sag, banana tree, stem and flowers are a whole lot of other vegetables. Pulses like masoor, mung, chana, ahar are used in their staple diet in everyday daily basis. Historical etiquettes. The typical Bengali fare includes a certain sequence of food and Bengali traditionally ate without silverware. Bengali love to eat with their hands, mashing small portion of rice, meat, vegetable, dolls, etc. In rural areas, Bengali traditionally eat sitting on the floor with a large banana or plantain leaf serving as a plate and plate made from the dry cell leaves sewed together. The procedures of hosting guests is to offer them food and drink as soon as they enter, adapting to mind, adapting to time. At times, the meal the host family may serve themselves only after guests have been served. But this must start with the respective eldest male and uh, continues first by age and then by gender. The cook, wife, and daughter in law are therefore the last to eat. Culinary influences Mughlai influence. Muslims conquered Bengal around the mid 13th century, bringing the Persian culture and cuisine. The culinary and the cultural influence had come from the upper cases, gradually diffusing into the lower classes, biryani and kurma. The influence has reinforced during the British rule of the British Raj, and where Kolkata became the place of refuge for many. Prominent exile nawabs. The exiles brought hundreds of cooks and masala cheese, made this a spice mixtures, with them uh, as their royal uh, patronage and wealth demised, dim, uh, diminished, and they became interspread into the local population. This cook came with the knowledge of a wide range of spice and extensive use of ghee and marinating meat with yogurt and chili. In Bangladesh, the food has become common fare of the population, while in West Bengal, they have remained the food of professional chef. Further innovations include chap, rizela, and kathi rolls. The Mughals had a particular fixation of meat bringing mutton into mainstream Bengali cuisine as well as already known kind of meat like uh, chicken and venison. Furthermore, traditional desserts have been primarily based on rice, paste and jaggery but under Mughal influence moved towards a significantly increased the use of milk, cream and sugar along with Expensive spices such as cardamom and saffron. Anglo Indian influences. Bengal was once the home of a French colony and also hosted populations of Portuguese, Dutch, and other Europeans. 
this collective western influence are seen in the food created to satisfy the taste of the western rulers the result is a unique cuisine local ingredient adapted to france and italian cooking technique characterized by creamy sauce the restrained use of spice and new techniques such as baking english and jewish bakers dominated the confectionery industry which migrated from british tables to the everyday bengali one resulting in unique creations such as the pate savory turnovers from the english pastry another enduring contribution to bengali cuisine is pav roti or western style bread raj ira cuisine leaves on specially in the varieties of finger foods popularized in the buka club of kolkata such as mutton chopped kabari raji cutlet and fish only many british family in india had local cooks and uh, through them discovered local food the food had to be modified to suit the taste of the mem sahibs the most distinct influence is seen in the desserts many of which were created significantly to satisfy the british sweet ledikeni named after the first vase rain lady caning it is a derivative of the pantua created for an even hosted by har odia influences During the 19th century many Odia cooks migrated to Bengal to work in the household of affluent Bengali families they were also had to cook in marriage and other family circles Odia brahman cooks from puri who worked in jagannath temple known as thakurs in and were in great demand Introducing an Oriya cooks in the Bengal kitchen brought its subtle but significant changes to Bengal cuisine. Many of the Bengali classic dishes were originally originally from Odisha but were refined in Bengali kitchen by Oriyan cooks. In fact, it says that dishes like rasgulla, kanika and mangsa kousa were first introduced to Bengali kitchen by Oriyan cook. although this is contested by others researchers even to this date most of the cooks in bengali kitchens and hotels are orient cooks chinese influence the chinese of kolkata originally settled in a village called achipur south of kolkata in the late 18th century later moving into the city the chinese origin people of kolkata form a substantial and successful community with a distinct identity with this identity came chinese food available at uh, almost every street corner in kolkata at present due to the taste of quick cooking procedures and uh, no similarity with the origin chinese recipe other than the use of the soy sauce indian chinese food was given a second boost since the 1950 when a large number of tibetan migrated into indian territory following the 14th dalai lama's fight tibetans brought with them their own delicacies such as a very popular kolso momo and thukpa tibetan and nepalese migrants also found ready employment in kitchen and helped power the many entries that serve the unique fusion on virtually every street in kolkata the chopsi became a favorite and verses like american chopsi and chinese chopsi were constantly talked about bengali meals the food of a daily meal are usually simpler geared to uh, balance nutritional and max extensive use of vegetables The course progressed broadly from lighter to rich and heavier. Rice remained common throughout the meal until the chutney courses. The starter follow uh, courses is bitter. The bitter changes with the season, but common ones are korola, which is available nearly throughout the year, or tender hem leaves in spring. Another bitter sweet preparations usually eaten in summer space, especially in West Bengal, is a 
super mixture of vegetables in a ginger mustard sauce called supto. This is followed by sag, such as spinach, methi greeks or um, fenugreeks. The dal course is usually the most sustained course. A common accompaniment to dal is bhaza, that's a fritters. Bhaza literally means a different. Another accompaniment is that a vegetable preparation usually made of multiple vegetables stewed slowly together without any added water. Labra, chorchori, gonto, or chanchara are all traditional cooking style. The next course is a fish, matcha jol, tel koi, doi match, chingri match, etc. Then comes the meat course. Kasi mutton or goat meat is traditionally the meat of choice, especially West Bengal, but murgi, chicken, and team egg are also commonly consumed. The chutney course, which is typically tangy and sweet, the chutney is usually made of arm, mango, tomatoes, anaros, pineapple, titul that is tamarind, pepe is a papaya, and just a combination of fruits and dry fruits. Speciality of cuisine for festivals of West Bengals are Durga Puja and Saraswati Puja Bok Lunch, Kichudi, Labra, Panch Bhaja, Tomato Chutney, Payas, Night Bok, Luchi, and Suji Halwa. Sankranti, Pethe Puli, Pati Sapta. Luchi, Gudar Bayes, Mocha Ganto, Prawns Malai, Curry, Dab Chingri, Rat, Bala, Rat Balabi, Osamakso, Aludum, and Cholardan. Thank you very much.